Hello friends, welcome to ProTalent and this is our module 3 of Legal Facts of India. I am sure all of you have started working on our static GK. Today's this module, in module, we are going to give you a lot of say, facts which are connected to our say, legal system of the country. This legal fact is that there is a or two questions so you will see this. We have tried to cover few information in this video, which all legal fact will come at a later stage. So just go through this and try to remember that. I am sure that all of you must have started making a separate copy of this particular modules. Start doing that. It will be very good for you in a long run. Let me start to talk about number one, legal facts of India, where we need to talk about possibly first or few more information connected to the legal aspect. Legal facts which are very important or uske liye ye sab chodi chodi cheeze aapko pata honi chahiye. Number one, who is the first lawgiver to India? Manu, unho ne Manu Smriti likhi thi and that was first codified law. Thik hai, ab ye jo Manu Smriti tha, wo baut baad mein ja kar usko proper way mein codify kiya gya alag alag, you can say ancient kitabo mein se so that is how the Manu is coming into picture. Another point is earliest codified law in India was under Gupta dynasty. Okay. Manu ne Manu Smriti likha tha. Okay. Konsi dynasty ne law ko codify kiya tha. It was Gupta dynasty. Currently there are 29 states and number of union territories are 7. We talked about this. You can say number of states. Uh, they are chief minister. They are governor in the second session of this static GK. Please go through that. Uske andar jo jo bhi information dekhe rakhi hai, please aap usko go through kariyega. Next is number of Supreme Court judges. This is a sanctioned limit. Okay. Bhai kitne honne chahiye? 30 judges plus one Chief Justice of India. This is a sanctioned limit. Interestingly, bohat baar ye pura bhar jata hai और बहुत बार नहीं भी बढ़ता है नंबर ऑफ हाई कोर्ट्स करंटली आर 24 बहुत ही लेटेस्ट तीन नई हाई कोर्ट आई थी ठीक है अभी देयर इज अ प्लान दैट एपी में देयर ओन हाई कोर्ट अ सेपरेट हाई कोर्ट सो देयर इज अ पॉसिबिलिटी कि नाउ वी विल हैव अ 25 नंबर सैंक्शन स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ हाई कोर्ट इन हाई कोर्ट जजेस इन आवर कंट्री देयर इज नो स्पेसिफिक लिमिट इट इज अप्रूव्ड फ्रॉम स्टेट टू स्टेट एंड हाउ मेनी जजेस पर मिलियन पीपल आर देयर इन इंडिया देयर आर 12 जजेस per million people. Now this is a star mark because this is varying number. Okay. Pehli federal court India mein kab banai gai? Federal court ka matlab hai center or state ke bich mein jo uh, relationship hai usko manage karna. Okay. Uske liye jo pehli uh, federal court banai gai that was in December 1937 in Delhi to decide on any dispute between the center as well as the state under government of India at 1935. Okay. The court Function for 12 years uh, till the Supreme Court was set up in January 28, 1950. Pehle Chief Justice of Federal Court the, Sir Maurice Guer, ye vice of the, and similarly the first Chief Justice of Supreme Court of India was Justice H. J. Kamya. Okay, I'm sure you know the current Chief Justice is Mr. Ranjan Gogoi. Okay, Mr. Ranjan Gogoi. Okay, first Preventive Detention Act of India, it was established in 1818 called Bengal State Prisoners Regulation Act, okay, provided for detention and deportation of political prisoners and revolutionaries without trial. Okay, first permanent Lok Adalat for tribal, tribal people ke liye permanent Lok Adalat was opened in Paderu in Andhra Pradesh in 2002, while first local adalat exclusively for women was established in, you can say on March 3, 2003 and it was at Delhi, okay, it was at Delhi and it was happening in 
to first woman judge of supreme court is you can say meer fatima bibi she was appointed as a first supreme court judge in 1989 she she is in the second woman in the world after sandra day o'connor of usa to be appointed as the high office that means she was also a federal court ki judge oldest high court in the country is a kolkata high court which was established in 1862 after kolkata it was madras and bombay those court was were open first litigation free village in our country first litigation matlab jahan pe koi bhi litigation nahi ho raha that is varavur panchayat in thrissur district of kerala okay theek hai 2000 mein ye litigation free village declare kiya gaya tha the highest compensation given in any case is union carbide uh, in that bhopal gas tragedy case which is 470 million dollar which is roughly 715 crore rupees bharat mein isse bada koi compensation abhi tak mila nahi hai first president for national consumer dispute redressal commission which is justice balakrishna iradi which is consumer redressal mechanism ke liye matlab consumer ki complaint hai aur usko address karne ke liye banaya gaya hai first woman high court chief justice is justice leela sheth theek hai justice leela sheth unke bete ka naam hai vikram sheth aur unhone kitab likhi thi a suitable boy to ye woman high court chief justice yaad rakhega ye largest number of states covered by one high court is guwahati high court okay which is serving to assam nagaland mizoram and arunachal pradesh first female lawyer in india is cornelia sorabji cornelia sorabji became the first female lawyer possibly in some round you can say 18th century uh, state where uniform civil code is applicable this is the only state in the country jahan pe applicable hai that is goa first census was conducted in our country was in 1872 and in 2011 the last census it was 15th census in our country first chief election commissioner is mr sukumar sen while first gentleman who has been awarded with bharat ratna is sri sri raj gopalachari and first mobile court was held at haryana okay so these are the few of the facts few more right to contest election remember it is not a fundamental right it is a statutory right it is not a fundamental right while right to vote is a legal right this is also not a fundamental right according to article number 32 and 226 of the constitution it guarantees the right to move supreme court for 32 it is supreme court for 226 it is high court ठीक है फॉर द एनफोर्समेंट ऑफ फंडामेंटल राइट फंडामेंटल राइट्स एनफोर्स करने के लिए वी कैन गो टू द हाई कोर्ट एंड वी कैन गो टू द सुप्रीम कोर्ट दिस इज सुप्रीम कोर्ट में जाना है तो आर्टिकल नंबर 32 के द्वारा पांच रीट्स होती है ओके फटाफट ये कमेंट सेक्शन में डाल दीजिए रीट्स क्या होती है ओके और कौन कौन सी रीट्स है हर एक का मतलब फटाफट अभी का अभी आपके मन में जो आ रहा है वो लिख दीजिए कमेंट सेक्शन में ओके उसको कहीं सर्च करने की जरूरत नहीं है आप अपने शब्दों में लिखे that will give you a good you can say revision constitution 42nd amendment is also known as mini constitution kyunki uske andar kafi zyada badlav aaya tha in fact in this constitution most of the things were changed the president addresses his resignation to the vice president of india this is very crucial okay yaad rakhna ye justice dalvir singh bandari is elected from india to icj okay इंटरनेशनल कोर्ट ऑफ जस्टिस आपको बताना है उनका टेन्यूर कितने समय का होगा और कौन से समय से कौन से समय के बीच में होगा प्लीज बताइएगा ये मुझे कमेंट सेक्शन में बिकॉज आई हैव ऑलरेडी टॉक्ट अबाउट दिस इन वन ऑफ द करंट अफेयर क्लास फर्स्ट ट्रायल बाय वीडियो कॉन्फ्रेंसिंग वॉज हेल्ड इन अप्रिल टू थाउजेंड थ्री इन अ डिस्ट्रिक्ट कोर्ट ऑफ मैसूर कर्नाटका मैसूर के अंदर यह अप्रिल टू थाउजेंड थ्री में हुआ था Another important part is National Judicial Academy is at Bhopal during general election to Lok Sabha in 2004 first time in all polling stations EVM was used okay you have to tell me first time EVM kab use hua tha 
ये मैंने आपको इंफॉर्मेशन दिया लोकसभा की ओके सो यू हैव टू टेल मी दैट ईवीएम ओके पहली बार कब यूज हुआ था जस्टिस के एन सिंह हेल्ड द पोस्ट ऑफ सीजीआई फॉर द शॉर्टेस्ट पीरियड ऑफ टाइम वाइल जस्टिस वाई वी चंद्रचूड हेल्ड द पोस्ट ऑफ सीजीआई फॉर द लॉन्गेस्ट पीरियड ऑफ टाइम सब अराउंड टू थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड एंड एटी नाइन डेज के लिए उन्होंने अगेंस्ट एस सीजीआई पोस्ट संभाली थी एंड द लास्ट पॉइंट फॉर द डे इज बार काउंसिल ऑफ इंडिया इज अ स्टेच्यूटरी बॉडी हैज बीन कॉन्स्टिट्यूटेड अंडर एडवोकेट्स एक्ट नाइनटीन सिक्सटी वन ओके इस ओके चलिए ग्रेट सो इन दिस मॉड्यूल दिस इज द ओनली थिंग फ्रॉम माई साइड बट इसको बिल्कुल याद रखेगा कॉपी में लिख लीजिए या तो नोट कुछ कुछ चीजों के बना दीजिए जो भी यहाँ दिमाग में घुस चुका है उसका तो बहुत अच्छा बात है क्योंकि उससे आपको कोई पंगा नहीं है क्योंकि दिमाग में घुस चुका है अब जो दिमाग में नहीं घुसा है उसको दिमाग में घुसाने की कोशिश करें ओके चलिए ग्रेट थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वॉचिंग दिस इफ यू लाइक दिस स्टडिक जी के पार्ट ठीक है प्लीज लाइक दिस वीडियो शेयर टू लॉट ऑफ योर फ्रेंड्स and tell to them that please join protalentdigital.com okay it is a kind of journey we have started to give you a very good support for your flat 2019 okay thank you very much all the best